Hi everyone, I'm Irma and in this video we'll talk about how to easily translate a WordPress site and make it multilingual. First, what does it mean to have a multilingual site? Let me show you. At this point you might be asking, why should you make multilingual sites? If you are not, you can skip straight to the tutorial, just follow the timestamps. And for those who are, here are some great reasons. For one, it can help reach a wider audience. If you have a business, you'll be able to tap into new markets and sell your products or services to people who speak different languages. It can also help improve your SEO. When you make your site multilingual, you'll be able to target different keywords in different languages. This will help you attract more organic traffic from search engines. And lastly, it can simply make your site more user-friendly for everyone. Imagine if you could read a website in your own language. Wouldn't that be great? And the best part is that making your WordPress website multilingual is actually quite easy, especially if you're using Visual Composer and WPML, which is a plugin that allows you to easily translate your content and make your site multilingual with a few simple steps. Before we jump into the tutorial, I wanted to tell you more about why we like WPML and why we think it's the best fit paired with Visual Composer. First of all, WPML is definitely the most comprehensive of its kind out there. You get the option to translate the site manually yourself or with the help of a translator or even better, they offer an automatic translation option too. Oh, and you can even connect with a trusted professional human translator through WPML's directory and translation management system so that you don't have to go searching for one on the web. We always say, and our customers say, that Visual Composer makes it easy for clients to maintain their sites. And the same is true for WPML. Once you deliver a site, your client will have all the necessary options to choose exactly how they want to create and maintain translations on their website. And when it comes to business, it's all about efficiency. And Visual Composer lets you create websites fast, and then WPML lets you translate fast. <laughs> so let me show you how this power combo actually works in real life. First things first, you'll need both plugins installed and activated. Then create your site page or post with Visual Composer. To do that, let's quickly create a new page with Visual Composer. And you can do that here from the Pages tab. This is our blank page wizard made for easy and quick setup. So let's make it a blank layout without any predefined styling. And I'm going to add one of our templates. So we already have some content to work with and translate. I'll take this product showcase and change the page name too. Okay, this is our page. Now only in English, but we want it to be in another language too that our potential customers would appreciate. By the way, everything in this template is customizable if you choose to try it out. So to translate this page to another language, let's save it and go back to WordPress and to Pages. This little plus icon next to our newly created page is the button that we need to click to add a translation. The first thing we see is the option to translate the page manually and an automatic translation. So obviously I'll choose the automatic translation. And now all I have to do here is to review and accept the translated words and phrases. If you want to change any of the translations, just write the new version in this text block and save. When this bar at the bottom turns green and we see 100% completion, we are done and can click on complete. If you choose to translate manually, this right side column will be empty and you'll be able to add the translation yourselves. But to be honest, I much rather prefer the review process and just being able to do less. Now let's check out the page. First in English, just like we left it. And now let's click on Latvian and boom, the whole page is in my native language. 
looks good to me. You probably don't know Latvian, but it looks good in Latvian too. Trust me on this one. Now that you know how to make your site multilingual and why, it's time to get started. When you pair Visual Composer and WPML, you get an incredibly efficient web design toolkit that will make creating beautiful multilingual websites a breeze. Ready to get started? Head on over to WPML.org to learn more about them and subscribe to our channel for more tutorials like this one.